there. It's Mrs. Ferris from Wood Library, and it's time for twos here. I've got my special friend with me, Violet, so come on out and say hi. Hi! Oh, she's getting much braver, isn't she? Let's get your petals nicely. So what is our theme going to be today, Violet? Oh, you want to show the book? Okay, you can help me. Oh. What does this book look like? Did you say a duck? You're right, this does look like a duck. This is called One, Two, Three with the Ten Little Rubber Ducks and it's written by Eric Carle. So let's do some counting. One, one. One little duck swims down the stream. Two, one, two. Two little ducks spy a bunny hopping. Can you hop like a bunny? I bet you can. What comes next? Three. One, two, three. Three little ducks hear chicks chirping. Cheep, 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 cheep. Can you cheep or chirp like a chick? It's fun to say. Cheep, 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 cheep. It looks like they've just hatched out of their eggs. Four. One, two, three, four. Four little ducks pass lambs frolicking. That's an interesting word, frolicking. I bet you frolic all the time and you didn't even know it. Those two little lambs are playing together. So frolicking means playing. What comes next? Five. One, two, three, four, five. Five little ducks see eggs hidden in the grass. Six. Can you count with me? One, two, three, four, five, six. Six little ducks float by leaping frogs. Can you leap? That's another word for jump or hop. They're jumping pretty high. Seven comes next. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven little ducks spot butterflies soaring. They're going way up high. I love the colors. There's red and purple and blue and orange and green. What color is your favorite? The next number is eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight little ducks see flowers growing. Oh, and I see a bee too. Bees are very important. When they buzz around the flowers, they're pollinating them. We're almost done. The next number is nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine little ducks hear birds singing. Tweet, 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 tweet. And the last one, oh, we've got two numbers here. There's a one and a zero, and when you put them together, it makes 10. Can we count up to 10 together? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten little ducks are happy that it is finally spring. It's not spring here, but I'm happy to meet those ten little ducks, aren't you? All right. Well, can we do a finger play about some ducks? Not sure if it's one we've done together on our videos yet. Can you hold up your five fingers? And with the other hand, can you make a mouth like this? These are the baby ducks and this is the mama duck. Five little ducks went out one day over the hills and far away. Stretch them out. The mama duck said quack, 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 but only four little ducks came back. Did you hide down one of your ducks like that? Bring your thumb in 
and then you have one, two, three, four left. Four little ducks went out one day over the hills and far away. Mama duck said quack, 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 but only three little ducks came back. Did you hide another one away? Okay. Three little ducks went out one day over the hills and far away. Mama duck said quack, 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 but only two little ducks came back. Two little ducks went out one day over the hills and far away. Mama duck said quack, 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 but only one little duck came back. One little duck went out one day over the hills and far away. Mama duck said quack, 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 quack. And this is going to be a surprise. Hide all of her ducks. But none of the five little ducks came back. So keep your arms stretched way out there because Mama's going to go looking. So sad mother duck went out that day over the hills and far away. Mama duck said quack, 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 quack. And all of the five little ducks came back and the mama was so happy to see them, she gave them each a great big kiss. And the ducklings were so happy to see their mama, they kissed her back. All right, let's get another story. And this is a story about opposites. It's called What's Up, Duck? And it's by Tad Hills. And I forgot to mention the publisher of the first book. Well, that is by Harper Collins. And this one is by Schwartzwade Books. You see one is looking up and one duck is looking down. Up and down are opposites. Front, back. Loud, quiet. Happy, sad. Near, far. Slow, fast, clean, dirty, heavy, light, up, down, awake, and what's the opposite of awake? Can you see from this picture? Asleep. Good night, ducks. Yes. Well, shall we do another finger play? How about if we cook our hot dogs? I've got my five little hot dogs that are cooking in the pan. The grease got hot and one went bam. So four little hot dogs are cooking in the pan. The grease got hot and one went bam. Three little hot dogs are cooking in the pan. The grease got hot and one went bam. Two little hot dogs are cooking in the pan. The grease got hot and one went bam. So one little hot dog is cooking in the pan. The grease got hot and the one went bam. So once again, how many do we have? None. No little hot dogs are cooking in the pan. The grease got hot and the pan went bam. Well, we have one more book and this is a little longer story, but I thought you were ready for it. This is called One Duck stuck. It's written by Phyllis Root and the pictures were drawn by Jane Chapman and it is published by K 
hand to Wick Press and we read it with their permission. Do you see how his foot is stuck in the mud? And he can't get out. He's gonna need some help. And I'm gonna let you know. Remember how we counted in the first book? We get to count again in this one. Well, down by the marsh, by the sleepy, slimy marsh, one duck gets stuck in the muck down by the deep green marsh. Ooh. Help, help, who can help? Who can help? Do you see the fish? And how many fish are there? Let's count them. One, two. Two we can, we can. Two fish, tails going swish, swim to the duck, splish splash. But no luck, the duck stays stuck, deep in the muck, down by the squishy, fishy marsh. Help, help, who can help? We can, we can. Does anybody know what those big animals are? I see three of them. They're moose. Three moose munching on spruce, plod to the duck, clomp, clomp. But no luck. The duck stays stuck deep in the muck down by the swampy, chompy marsh. Help, help, who can help? We can, we can. Oh my goodness. Those are hmm. four crickets chirping in the thickets leap to the duck beep beep but no luck the duck stays stuck deep in the muck down by the pricky sticky marsh help help who can help we can we can what are those? Frogs, and there are five of them. Five frogs hopping on logs, jump to the duck, plop, plop. But no luck, the duck stays stuck, deep in the muck, down by the creaky, croaky marsh. Help, help, who can help? We can, we can. Do you know what that animal is? If I do this one, you know who that animal is? Those are skunks and there are six of them. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six skunks climbing over trunks, crawl to the duck, plunk, plunk. But no luck, the duck stays stuck, deep in the muck, down by the soggy, loggy marsh. Help, help. Who can help? We can, we can. What do we see now? Those are snails and there are seven snails. Mm-hmm. Seven snails making slippery trails. Slide to the duck, slush, slush. But no luck, the duck stays stuck. Deep in the muck, down by the slippy sloppy marsh. Help, help, who can help? We can, we can. Oh, what are there eight of? I see the number eight. Do you know what those animals are? Hmm? Those are possums. Eight possums nibbling on blossoms crawl to the duck, slosh, slosh. But no luck, the duck stays stuck deep in the muck down by the reedy weedy marsh. Oh, forgot the part over here. Help! Can you say that with me? I'd love to have your help. And that's what part of it is. Help! Help! Who can help? We can! We can! Oh my goodness, what are there nine of? Can you tell? First I thought they were worms, but they're not worms. Do you know what they are? You're right if you said snakes. Nine snakes leaving little wakes slither to the duck, slink, slink. 
but no luck. The duck stays stuck deep in the muck down by the messy, mossy marsh. Help, help, who can help? We can, we can. There are 10 of them this time, 10 dragonflies. There's the 10 again, zooming through the skies, whirr to the duck, zing, zing. But no luck, the duck stays stuck, deep in the muck, down by the muggy, buggy marsh. Oh. Help, help, who can help? We can, we can. Do you see they're all there? All the animals? The two animals and the three animals and all the animals, even up to the dragonflies. So with a splish and a clomp and a pleep and a plop and a plunk and a slush and a slosh and a slink and a zing. If you had this book at home, you could identify each of those animals. They all help the duck who got stuck in the muck. Spluck! Do you see his foot is out? He's free. Should we say hooray? Hooray! Thanks, said the duck, who got out of the muck down by the deep green marsh. And there he goes, flying away. Well, can you wiggle your fingers and wiggle your toes? Can you wiggle your shoulders? And how about your nose? Can you wiggle your elbows? Can you slap your knees and stretch your arms up? And get ready, please, because we're going to have a song on the flannel board today. I bet it has a duck in it. But it also has a barn. And a farmer. We'll put the barn over here because we really don't need it. But can you guess who lives in the barn? Do people live in barns? Not usually, but lots of animals do. Well, we're on our way, we're on our way, on our way to Grandpa's farm. We're on our way, we're on our way, on our way to Grandpa's farm. Well, down on Grandpa's farm, there is a little yellow duck. Down on Grandpa's farm, there is a little yellow duck. The duck, it always goes like this, quack, quack. The duck, it always goes like this, quack, quack. Down on Grandpa's farm, there is a black and white cow. Down on Grandpa's farm, there is a black and white cow. Do you remember what a cow says? The cow, it always goes like this, moo. The cow, it always goes like this, moo. Well, down on Grandpa's farm, there is a little red hen. Down on Grandpa's farm, there is a little red hen. The hen, it always goes like this. Bark, bark, bark. The hen, it always goes like this. Bark, bark, bark. Down on Grandpa's farm, there is a fat pink. Can you guess? Pig. Down on Grandpa's farm, there is a fat pink pig. The pig. It always goes like this, oink, oink. The pig, it always goes like this, oink, oink. Well, down on Grandpa's farm, there is a new spring lamb. Down on Grandpa's farm, there is a new spring lamb. The lamb, it always goes like this, ba ba The lamb, it always goes like this, ba ba well, down on Grandpa's farm, there is a big brown horse. Down on Grandpa's farm, there is a big brown horse. The horse, it always goes like this. I'm going to put you in front.
because I don't think they'll see you. The horse, it always goes like this. <laughs> well, down on Grandpa's farm, there is a spotted brown dog. I almost forgot him. Down on Grandpa's farm, there is a spotted brown dog. The dog, it always goes like this. Woof, woof, woof. The dog, it always goes like this. Woof, woof, woof. That's a lot of animals, isn't it? But we've got one more thing to add, and it's not an animal, but you'll find it on a farm. Well, down on Grandpa's farm, there is an old green tractor. Down on Grandpa's farm, there is an old green tractor. The tractor, it always goes like this. Put, put, put. The tractor, it always goes like this. Put, put, put. Well, we're on our way. We're on our way, on our way to Grandpa's farm. We're on our way. We're on our way, on our way to Grandpa's farm. And that's our song. Now, before we go, I think since we had two books that had counting in them, we ought to count the animals on Grandpa's farm so we'll be able to tell if they're all there. So can you help me count? Start over here with the hen. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven animals, plus one tractor, and most important of all, one grandpa. Well, thank you so much for tuning in and listening to our stories about ducks. We did some counting today, and I hope you'll come back again soon. And Violet and I will be here with some more stories. See you later. Bye-bye.